What is the deadliest aircraft in the skies? With the top speed of over twice the speed of sound and the ability to pull over 9 Gs, the world's most advanced fighter jet is the ally you want and the enemy that even the bravest fear. This multi-mission aircraft is nearly invisible to radar systems and can conduct air-to-air -air combat, ground attacks, electronic warfare, surveillance, and more. Meet the incredible F-22 Raptor. The Lockheed Martin Boeing F-22 Raptor is a fifth-generation single-seat fighter jet. It's one-of-a-kind combination of super cruise, super maneuverability, stealth, and sensor fusion all into one platform makes the Raptor the first of its kind. The F-22 is a dual-engine aircraft, with each Pratt & Whitney turbofan engine producing up to 35,000 pounds of force, more than any other fighter engine. At military power, it can fly an astonishing 1.8 Mach, or nearly 1,400 miles per hour. This ability to fly at supersonic speeds without using afterburners is called Super Cruise. With afterburners on, the Raptor is even more impressive and can exceed Mach 2, over 1,500 miles per hour, earning it a spot among the fastest operational aircraft in the world. The Raptor has an impressive thrust-to-weight ratio of about 1 to 1 in normal cruise and 1.25 to 1 with afterburners, which enable the aircraft to seemingly defy gravity. It is able to execute near-vertical climbs with ease, can make unimaginably tight turns, and it is so dominant it can outmaneuver every other aircraft in the world. The ability to perform such maneuvers proves that the F-22 is capable of super maneuverability. The shape and design features of the F-22 all are centered around performance and stealth. The aircraft has swept wings and a specially designed fuselage to help avoid detection from enemy radar systems. It has special coatings and utilizes radar absorbent materials to further help shield the plane from detection. It is also one of the few aircraft that are capable of carrying its weapon stores internally, again to maximize stealth characteristics and aerodynamic performance. The avionic systems of the Raptor are second to none. Through sensor fusion, large quantities of data are collected from the jet's internal systems as well as off-board sensors and combined to give the pilot a picture of the flight. Inputs from onboard radar, missile detectors, electronic attack systems, and more all combine to allow pilots to track threats like enemy aircraft, surface-to-air missiles, air-to-air -air missiles, employ ordnance of their own, and employ electronic countermeasures against hostile forces. The maximum range for the Raptor is over 1,850 miles. It can operate at altitudes as high as 65,000 feet MSL and can pull up to 9 Gs at its maximum weight. The increased abilities of the Raptor make it a much more formidable enemy to go up against. Its higher ceiling improves the operation of its sensors and systems. It has lower drag and better fuel efficiency, as well as higher survivability with regard to surface threats. This is a huge advantage over other fighter jets. When comparing the Raptor to some of its counterparts in the U.S. fleet, the F-16 Fighting Falcon and the F-A-18 Super Hornet, both aircraft have ceilings of just over 50,000 feet and maximum ranges of 1,260 and 1,400 miles respectively. It is clear that the F-22 is far superior in its abilities, even amongst some of the world's best aircraft, as it can fly and fight higher, faster, and longer than the rest. The Raptor is a multi-mission aircraft. It has extensively performed intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance missions, as well as provided close air support, has electronic attack capabilities, and is a crucial element to the United States Air Force fleet. The Raptor has three weapons bays and typically carries AIM-9 Sidewinders and AIM-120 AMRAAM missiles. However, in the future, it is expected that the F-22 will upgrade to carrying AIM-260 Joint Advanced Tactical Missiles. It is also typically outfitted with JDAMs and GPS-guided bombs. Additionally, the Raptor has an internal Vulcan 20mm rotary cannon, and pilots have the ability to see a radar projection of its fire path on their heads-up display. The main weapons bay can be re-outfitted to carry a total of 2,000 pounds of bombs rather than missiles, and additional weapons can be carried if mounted to the wing attachments. 
the F-22 also carries flares for protection against infrared missiles. F-22 first entered service in 2005. It first displayed its capabilities at the Northern Edge and Red Flag Friendly Training Exercise in 2006 and 2007, and was deemed fully operationally capable shortly after. The Raptor flew its first missions in 2007 while taking part in Operation Noble Eagle and first intercepted Russian 295 bombers later that year. The F-22 also saw its first deployment in 2007 to Japan and made its first deployment to the Middle East in 2009. Since, Raptors have performed numerous combat missions throughout the region. F-22 is credited with participating in strikes during Operation Inherent Resolve, targeting ISIS in 2014. They dropped hundreds of bombs throughout Syria in 2014 and 2015 and participated in the bombing of opium facilities in Afghanistan in 2017. Most recently, a F-22 Raptor was credited with shooting down a Chinese spy balloon off the coast of South Carolina at roughly 60,000 feet after it traveled across the United States. This incident, occurring in February 2023, earned the Raptor its first air-to-air -air kill. Raptors are credited with shooting down additional objects in the skies above Alaska and the Yukon in the days following. As one would expect, the F-22 has faced its fair share of problems since its introduction. In December 2004, a jet crashed during takeoff, resulting in a grounding of the Raptor fleet. The investigation found a flight control system issue resulting from an interruption in power during a previous engine shutdown on the ground. The results were integrated into the design of the aircraft to prevent future mishaps. During the initial years of operation, multiple Raptor pilots reported experiencing symptoms related to a lack of oxygen or hypoxia, ranging from respiratory issues to memory loss, loss of consciousness, and more. This led the Air Force to ground the jet for months in 2011, investigating the issue, ultimately finding a gear malfunctioning that was restricting oxygen flow from the oxygen supply unit to the pilots. The faulty equipment was replaced and jets were outfitted with backup oxygen supply systems to add an extra layer of protection for pilots. Currently, there are seven Raptor squadrons consisting of a total of 186 aircraft. Although original plans called for a much larger order, the program was scaled down due to cost concerns. With estimates coming in as high as $350 million per jet, the price tag is a major hangout. For reference, it is over five times the price of the F-16, coming in at $63 million apiece. The United States Air Force is the only military branch in the world operating the aircraft, with squadrons based at Joint Base Langley in Virginia, Holloman Air Force Base in New Mexico, Eglin and Tyndall Air Force Bases in Florida, Nellis Air Force Base in Nevada, Joint Base Elmendorf-Richardson in Alaska, and Hickman Air Force Base in Hawaii. The F-22 has never been exported to other countries, largely due to the high cost of the aircraft and its integration in advanced classified technology. If the jet was to fall into the wrong hands, it could eliminate a strong tactical advantage the United States holds. Although a relatively young addition to the United States Air Wing, the F-22 already has a strong combat history and is expected to remain in service through the 2030s as a crucial element of the fleet. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe to our channel and leave a like in the comments. Until next time.